Hello. Welcome to another reaction video. Today I'll be looking into Missing Teeth, The Plague. I don't know if The Plague is a song or Missing Teeth is the song. Regardless, I'm listening to it. Heath Palace recommended it to me. I've seen you commenting on a lot of the videos. I really appreciate that. You seem very energetic and very uh, just enthusiastic about the punk scene and a lot of the music that I've been enjoying. So that's really cool, man. And, uh, you know, I gotta check this out. You seem, you seem to know your shit. So let's see it. This is live in the New Zealand Punk Fest 2007. Recommended to me. Let's see what's going on in New Zealand. What them Kiwi boys up to? Alright, I'm gonna stop here for a second. Fucking Ladies and gentlemen, I wanna welcome on the stage. Fanny. Mr. Fanny. Fanny, get out here. Is everybody around the Oh yeah, that's Fatty, alright. <laughs> Fucking sick, bruh. Fucking sick. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Established 1999. Okay, they've been at it. So there's some fucking veterans in the game, innit? I'm just gonna have this as a nice... Let's start doing that. Just find a nice little thumbnail to, to review shit on, you know? So some... Alright, so... Let's get into this, yeah? Now, when I listen to... Live music, I think it's important for me to understand the culture of the, the not only the, the band, but also the audience around there. Because uh, why else would you listen to it live? You know, when when they do video, uh, you know, studio recordings, they're trying to put out the cream of the crop for that song, right? But when they're doing it live, it's raw emotion, is showing what encompasses that. And that, I mean, that's big with punk, right? You're not really trying to listen. <laughs> you're not necessarily trying to listen to punk on thousand dollar speakers necessarily you're trying to go to a punk show and listen to punk you know on um, their thousand dollar speakers but um so i looking into this things that come to mind uh the aesthetic is very like it's just classic you know studded jackets with the fucking you know the mohawks and the, you know the hair and shit like that and you got some guys in their hoodies of course but i uh, it i'm assuming that the folk that are that with all the dyed hair and whatnot, they're definitely showing out for the punk fest, the really deep in the scene type of thing. Uh, the the venue itself is not very large, and so it's you know it's very intimate space. And despite them be called missing teeth, you would assume it's a very aggressive elbow to the face type of band. 
And it definitely hears that in how they're, uh, you know, sonically, how they're playing all their stuff. Uh, but the crowd itself, there, there's, there's a, more of a, a loving atmosphere than that. There's, there isn't malice to each other. There's malice to maybe what they're talking about. But the, they're not they're not trying to break each other's teeth necessarily. Not really trying to get into fights. It looks like people are having a good ass time, which I can definitely love. You know, if you got this like annual punk festival type thing, I'm assuming it's like one, the biggest one in New Zealand. You're not there to make enemies. You know, you're there you're there to have a good ass time. So I respect the the respect and the love that everyone seems to have for each other. You know, to a degree, of course, because it is a punk show. Sonically, I, it was, it's a very classic sounding punk uh, sounds to me, just like old school. You know, what, I've, what, I've, what I think of when I think of punk from like friends who were into punk and they would show me a tune every now and then. This is definitely what I think of. You know, just kind of, uh, you got your, you know, like hook, bridge, choruses that are just going in and then, you know, verse that, to be honest, I don't know what the hell people are saying, but they shouting and they mean it. And so I can respect that they are passionate and then back to the you know the chorus we got the plague that we all get sick you know just like the plague we all get sick i don't necessarily know what sickness they're talking about if there's lyrics i'll check it out but yeah i i, I i'm glad you recommended it to me i love seeing that this is what the kiwi punk scene i'm guessing looks like at least in 2007 i'm curious what it looks like you know a decade and a half later if you know what what if it's the same generation of people or if it's newer generation, if they brought their own swagger into it, you know, that's always interesting to see this, you know, the progression of genres in regional areas to, to be exact. So yeah, I, uh, thanks for recommending it to me. Heath. appreciate you, man. Have a great day. All of you, you deserve it.